From wedding bells to unexpected adventures, our beloved actors are living their best lives off-screen, and we've got all the details. Whether it's B&B star Katrina Bowden's wedding update, on-screen little Harrison new movie project, Why and her star saving lives and many more. So without any further ado, let's get right into the video. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. It's comforting to know that real life often has a happier ending than the drama-filled lives of our favorite soap characters. We're talking about the bold and the beautiful Swyatt and Flo, whose relationship seems to have fizzled out on screen and might be off the radar for good. Darren Brooks, who portrayed Wyatt, hinted last fall that his time on the show was over, leaving fans to wonder if Flo and Wyatt will ever get their fairy tale ending. But while Wyatt and Flo might be facing a forever hiatus, Katrina Bowden, who played Flo, is gearing up for a real life happily ever after. Bowden recently shared a wedding planning update with her fiancé, musician Adam Taylor, letting fans in on their journey down the aisle. According to Page Six, the couple has already picked out their wedding rings, though the venue is still up in the air. But hey, they're making more progress than Wyatt and Flo ever did. Bowden humorously documented her planning on Instagram, stating, Lots more to plan, but at least we found our wedding rings. Priorities, right? She even joked saying, Dress and ring shopping is better than other parts of wedding planning. The couple's engagement was announced back in September 2023, after making their relationship public in 2021. And let us tell you, the fans were equally surprised as Bowden about the news, and they couldn't be any happier for the couple. In fact, Bowden's engagement ring, which she described as blinding, took center stage and became a hot topic among her fans. I mean, that's the type of ring Flo deserved from Wyatt, but, oh well. She even shared a little wedding dress shopping video, and looked gorgeous in all that she tried. But since she said she wanted to have a beach wedding, the final dress is probably going to be based on it. After all, no one wants a train dragging through the sand or a super heavy dress in the hot weather. But wherever Bowden and Taylor end up tying the knot, we're sure it will be a picture-perfect day, that's everything Flo and Wyatt could only dream of. So till then, we're counting down the days along with the bride, until we can see her in all white for the big day, looking absolutely beautiful. Meanwhile, the young and the restless star Zuleika Silver, aka Audra, took a much different turn in her personal life, that too involving firearms. Silver recently hit up a gun range but had a few hiccups along the way, and let's just say, it wasn't exactly smooth shooting. Filming the experience on her Instagram stories, Silver shared her journey to the range, starting with a video, where she was all geared up with protective eyewear and headphones. But the sound of gunfire left her visibly anxious. In her next video, she admitted that despite being there, she realized she wasn't entirely comfortable with handling a gun. I started getting really anxious, she explained, and I realized that like, actually I don't really know how to handle a gun. Not wanting to spoil her friend's fun, she decided to sit this one out, but assured fans she'd eventually take a class to learn the ropes. With a touch of humor, she promised to prove her skills as a Lara Croft 2.0 in the future. She also shared another photo of herself mentioning how her fans were grilling her on Instagram for her shooting skills. So to decompress from the stress, Silver cuddled up with her adorable grey cat, Hemingway, who was apparently prescribed to her, and introduced as her emotional support. But hilariously, according to her, he might be the one needing support. I think most of the time he doesn't do his job, and I think I'm his ESA, emotional support adult, she joked. Silver's light-hearted take on the whole experience shows that even in stressful situations, she knows how to keep things entertaining and relatable. But in all seriousness, this probably looks like her first and last shooting class. Speaking of keeping things light and fun, the young and the restless cutie Redding Munsell, everyone's favorite little Harrison, is making waves, like literally. How, you ask? By going from soaps to the big screen at such a small age. The talented young actor is set to star in the upcoming movie, At the Sea, and it sounds like he had a blast on set. Munsell shared a reel on Instagram, featuring behind-the-scenes snaps, videos from his time filming, and even a sweet selfie with co-star Amy Adams. At the Sea follows Laura, played by Adams, a woman who returns to her family's beach house after rehab, trying to adjust to her new life. Munsell, who plays Felix, will be part of this star-studded cast, which also includes Jenny Slate, Dan Levy, and Rain Wilson. While the filming just wrapped up and is heading to post-production, we can't wait to see how Munsell's talent shines on the silver screen, especially after his impressive performance in the Oscar-nominated short film Red, White, and Blue. I mean, he even got nominated for a Young Artist Award. This young actor is clearly going places. But what's a little screen time without some off-screen fun? Wyanner star Michelle Stafford, who plays Phyllis, recently took a well-deserved break with her kids at Disneyland. And by the looks of it, she had just as much fun as her character often does causing chaos in Genoa City. 
Through her Instagram stories, Stafford shared their fun-filled experience, which included rides like Radiator Springs Racers and A Little Mermaid, Ariel's Undersea Adventure. Though the latter ride hit a bit of a snag and briefly got stuck, it didn't seem to bring down their spirits one bit. Stafford also showed us some classic Disney moments, including a selfie where she rocked a pair of golden, sparkly Minnie Mouse ears, giving the camera a cheeky sideways glance. I mean, it's clear that she was fully soaking in the Disney spirit, and we all loved it. But wait, the thrills didn't stop there. Stafford and her daughter, Natalia, also took on the Incredicoaster, a high-speed roller coaster perfect to get you all hyped up and scared. And as she said, they both are definitely thrill seekers. Stafford also shared the excitement on her Instagram, showing that she's just like the rest of us when it comes to the magic of Disney. One particular picture that we loved was when Stafford hugged Mickey Mouse like a little kid. With a matching gold and sparkly Minnie Mouse backpack, it was obvious that this wasn't just a treat for her kids. Stafford was enjoying every minute of it too. Mickey's big hug was the cherry on top of an already amazing day. In her Instagram caption, she also thanked Disneyland for the most incredible weekend. And the timing couldn't be any better. The actress went there during the D23 Expo 2024, a major Disney event where Disney Park announced major projects, including new cars and villains installations at Magic Kingdom and a new land called Tropical Americas at Animal Kingdom featuring attractions based on Encanto and Indiana Jones. Over at Hollywood Studios, a Monsters, Inc. expansion is in the works, while Disney's California Adventure is getting an Avengers Campus expansion with two new rides and a cutting-edge Avatar-themed attraction. It sounds like Stafford and her family had the perfect weekend at Disneyland. It's always great to see our favorite stars enjoying some well-deserved downtime, and Stafford's Disney adventure was definitely one for the books. Finally, in a heartwarming twist, Y and R's J, Eddie Peck proved that heroes don't just exist on TV, they walk among us. Peck recently took part in the 10 Years of Clear the Shelters event, a nationwide initiative to find homes for shelter animals. He posted about the event on Instagram, sharing a flyer and a selfie with his golden retriever, then, encouraging fans to join the cause. Peck's commitment to rescuing animals doesn't stop at events, though. He and his wife, Sonia, recently took in a dog named Milo, who was on the euthanasia list at their local shelter due to overcrowding. Thanks to Peck's efforts, Milo found a temporary home with the Pecks, who are now working to find him a forever family. Peck's heartfelt posts about Milo struck a chord with fans, who praised him for his compassion and dedication to saving animals in need. From wedding bells to Hollywood stardom, gun ranges to Disney magic, and even saving lives, these soap stars show us that while their on-screen lives may be full of drama, their real lives are as fun. And who doesn't love a happy ending? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.